Thank you for joining us for Real Estate in the Low Country. I'm Betsy McDaniel. As usual, we'll get started with a few headlines. The 2020 census is scheduled to hit, the mail hit mailboxes in just six months, and the National Association of Realtors is encouraging its members and clients to complete the form quickly and accurately. Why does it matter? Well, while the primary purpose of the census is to ensure all states have proper representation in Congress, it may also mean a great deal of funding in other areas within the community. The once-in-a-decade exercise used to determine federal funding is used to determine federal funding for hospitals, schools, libraries, and housing programs. For the first time ever, the Census Bureau will accept responses electronically as well as by phone or mail. The move to online is expected to encourage more Americans to complete the census. According to recently published research from Apartment List, the trend of young adults choosing to live with their parents into their late 20s and early 30s that grew during the Great Recession when ballooning student debt became a crisis has yet to let up. Fifty years ago, 76% of 26-year-olds in the U.S. lived with a spouse. Today that has dropped to just 24%. That same age group is 46% more likely to live with a parent than in 2007. For those that do opt to branch out on their own, they are still choosing housing or so housing arrangements that differ from previous generations, like moving in with a partner before marriage or having a non-family member roommate. 65% of new home construction is sold through a real estate agent, and with many of our local communities having low inventory, agents told the multiple listing service of Hilton Head that they needed a tool to explore new construction. So HHI MLS has partnered with Builders Update to provide a tool to do just that giving members info on new communities in the Lowcountry. HHI MLS facilitated more than $4 billion in real estate transactions last year. Check out the media sources on your screen for more information on these and other stories, and check us out on Facebook and Twitter as well. Much more to come, so don't go away.